Chad Brendel, BearcatJournal.com, here with Wyatt Fisher. Wyatt, had a, uh, had a, had a solid spring yeah. and, and kind of made a name for yourself, and now you're out here at camp backing it up and then starting to make some plays. How does it, uh, what's that feeling like trying to play yourself into some playing time? It feels great. I mean, just working hard and trying to get as many reps as I can and really just hard every play that I'm in. It, one of the keys, I'm sure, is opportunity, and, and unfortunately, uh, Mooj goes down with a with a with a knee, and that opens the door. Did you think to yourself like, now's the time I got to turn it on and, and yeah. really make a, a, an impact? I was actually playing on the opposite side of the yeah. field, and the coach was just like, I need you to play W. So I just stepped up and just get as many reps as I can. How has uh, working with Mike Brown been? Has that been an impact in yeah. in the resurgence you've had? Yeah, Mike Brown's a great coach. Honestly, one of my favorite receiver coaches I've ever had. He's taught me a lot since I've been here. How did you end up at Cincinnati? To take me through the story of getting here and walking on. So I live about 50 minutes away. I went to a small school called Western Brown. And I just came on a couple game day visits. I had a couple like small D2 offers, but I don't know, when I came here, it just felt right. And all the coaches, I don't know, I just loved talking to Coach Vic and stuff. I just bought in right away. Did you know any of the other local guys that were coming? or? I knew their names, but I didn't really like, okay. actually know them. So. How was how was your first year getting used to everything and and getting acclimated to college football and, and trying to put yourself in this position yeah, you're in now? I mean, it's a lot different from where I come from because I played Division three football in high school, so a little bit of a speed change, but I love it. So, hey, how has your confidence grown? Does it feel like with each passing day out here, you feel like you belong more and more? Yeah, especially after spring football this year, I got a lot more reps and I know the playbook a lot better, so. I don't know, it just allows me to play faster now. So. Did, did it get, I don't want to say frustrating, but they brought a bunch of guys in, transfers, and there were additions to the roster in the summer. Did that get discouraging maybe a little bit, or did you just think, I just got to be even better? I mean, me being a walk-on, it's always been like, I'm sort of like the back guy, so like, I just know that I always have to work hard every opportunity that I did, so it didn't really discourage me that much. But. Have you been doing special teams work? Where where you stand on that? You think maybe you can maybe get on the field on special teams yeah, as well? Actually, right now I'm on first team kickoff, kickoff return, and punt blocks. So. so three special teams yeah. units. Uh, tell me about Coach Mason and how he is as a special teams yeah, coach. He's a great coach. He's really intense, but he knows his stuff. And I love working with him. He, he, he's kind of different because he doesn't say a whole lot, but when he says it, it you, you know. Yeah, he gets his point across. <laughs> uh, tell me about the quarterbacks. You, you, you work a lot with Ben being a, on yeah. the second team right now, but yeah. you get some reps from Dez and from the younger guys and Sopko. What do you think? Yeah, Ben and Sopko. I mean, I talk to Ben a lot outside of the practice and stuff, so me and him are pretty close. And then the other quarterbacks are just really great. I mean, it's a lot better than what I had in high school, not going to lie. I mean, yeah. How much tougher did it get in the spring? Most of the cornerbacks were hurt. And now they've got guys healthy, yeah. and they've got new guys coming in. You've got the, the, the freshman guys in Harris and yeah. and, uh, and Sauce, as he likes to be called. Yeah, <laughs> um, tell me about the corners and, and what it's like working against those guys. Yeah, well, I mean, in the spring, I sort of had like a tweak hamstring a little bit, so like, I was kind of down with it, but I mean, now, I don't know. It's good testing yeah, yourself yeah, against the, the better guys. Yeah. Especially like tonight, we got to go two against one, so I had to go against like Kobe Bryant, those guys. And, you don't get thrown at much when Kobe's on you, do you? No. <laughs> <laughs> All right, thanks. Appreciate it, Wyatt. Thanks.